A vote of no confidence in the French government was narrowly avoided when it pushed through an increase in the pension age to 64. 278 votes were cast in favor of the vote, which centrist lawmakers proposed, falling shy of the required 287 votes. Emmanuel Macron would have had to form a new administration or call fresh elections if it had been successful. The far-right National Rally Party's second no-confidence motion was equally unsuccessful. The contentious bill to raise the retirement age from 62 to 64 will now become law as a result of both votes failing. The votes were held after the measure was passed last week without a vote thanks to Prime Minister Elizabeth Bourne's use of a unique constitutional provision known as Article 49.3. It provoked irate demonstrations over the weekend, with some protesters engaging in physical altercations with law enforcement and blocking roadways in downtown Paris and other cities around the nation with burning debris. Following the unsuccessful elections on Monday, there were new protests in the capital, which resulted in a tense standoff between protesters and anti-riot police.